What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the Montana State Dynasty on NCAA Football 06. Today, we've got ourselves the championship game in the Superdome down in Louisiana, in uh, New Orleans. It's going to be between the Ohio State Buckeyes and the Oklahoma Sooners. The Sooners uh, have a uh, Heisman winner. He won the Heisman most recently. His name, uh, you might have heard of him, Adrian Peterson. But unfortunately for them, he is out for today's game. So that could be a major blow for them. Ohio State is ranked number one. Um, they are the favorites going into this game. But uh, you don't count Oklahoma out. Ohio State gets the football to start off. Not a very good return here, though, as they only get up to about the 15. We're going to pick up third down and five. And down goes the quarterback. That is Dwayne Burton, who is the quarterback in the Buckeyes. He is sacked on that play. Now the Sooners have the football. They're giving it to the backup running back. And he gets them into Buckeyes territory. We also have an injured Ohio State player. But he will return to the game. They're faced with another third down situation here. They give it to the running back, but this time he is denied the first down. So they're going to have to attempt a 46-yard field goal here. And the kicker comes out. The kick is up, and it is good. And the Sooners get on the board. So now here is Burton looking to pass, and he goes down again. Sacked for the second time today. And that's going to force them to punt the ball back to Oklahoma. But Oklahoma was unable to do anything with the football. So now Ohio State's got it again. They give it to their impact running back. Running around defenders. Making the defense look silly. He's going to take this all the way to the house. Touchdown Buckeyes. A big 79-yard run there is going to give Ohio State the lead in this game here. Look at this replay. He did a great job following his blockers, first of all, and then just making moves on defenders. He, you know, a little stutter step and whatnot there, and he was gone. So can Oklahoma respond to that? The quarterback takes the snap. This is Derek Givens here, and he connects with his man to move the chains. A nice throw from him. Third down and one. Givens tosses this one out to the running back who runs a man over, but then is stripped of the football, and Ohio State is there for the recovery. A good run there to convert the third down, but unfortunately for the Sooners, they give it back to Ohio State. Here's a toss play now for the running back at Ohio State here. He's going to get them just to the red zone. There's a 20-yard line in the red zone, or do you have to be inside the 20? I don't know, but all I know now is that they are in the red zone after this. A nice run here gets them down to the 7. Third down and goal. Burton looking to pass. Throws off his back foot there, and he connects with his man for the Buckeyes touchdown. And that's going to extend this lead out to 11 now as they're going to lead 14-3. Just seven seconds left to go in the first half, and the Sooners are going to need to attempt a Hail Mary. Here it goes. Givens taking a deep shot. It is tipped, and he is going to be picked off. There's zeros on the clock. Ohio State not able to get a pick six there, so that's going to take us to the halftime where the Buckeyes lead 14-3. The Sooners get the football to start off the third quarter, and there is Givens firing over the middle to move the chains. A nice throw from him. Second down and seven play fake. There he connects with his man who turns it upfield across midfield inside of the 40-yard line before he steps out of bounds. On second down, Givens looking to pass. He's going to go underneath to his man who's going to cut it upfield here and gets them inside of the red zone down at about the 14-yard line. That's three consecutive completions now for Derek Givens. Givens looking to throw here. Goes to the uh, his tight end there, who somehow is able to make that reception, but he is going to be inches shy of the first down marker. So they're going to attempt another field goal, which is up and good. And that's going to make this an eight-point game. The Buckeyes trying to extend their lead. Burton's going to dump this one off to his running back, who gets away from the first man there. Picks up the first down and a little bit more after that. First down and 10. It's a toss play now to the running back. He's taking this one to the right side. He's going to get them inside of the 40 into Sooners territory. First play of the four, fourth uh, quarter now. A deep shot there from Dwayne Burton, but his pass is tipped. And they're going to have to attempt this 50-yard field goal, which is up. 
and it is good. That makes this a two-possession game yet again. The Sooners end up having to punt as Ohio State gets the stop here. Punting this one away now, looking to get a good return. Down the left sideline, across midfield, brought down just inside of the 40. Second down and 12 for the Bucks. They'll give it to the running back, and he's having quite the game so far today. Another pickup of about 15 yards. They have over 100 yards rushing, while uh, Oklahoma is definitely missing Adrian Peterson. They are going to give it to their running back again, but he coughs up the football, and the Sooners pick it up, trying to come back in the fourth quarter here with just about three minutes left to play. They needed that turnover. Great job by Walters forcing that one out, and then Oklahoma recovering the loose ball. So now it's going to be first down and 10. First play of the drive, throwing that one to the right side. It's going to be caught. He spins around and picks up about a first down there. Now they're faced with a third down. Givens throws to the right side there. He connects with his running back, and that's going to move the chains, and then he steps out of bounds. Now Givens is throwing this one to the left side. His receiver catches it. He turns it upfield inside of the 40-yard line there, down to about the 30. A nice pass and catch here. He's been throwing a lot of, of short routes so far today, and his receiver has been doing a lot of the work turning it upfield, but they have yet to get into the end zone. Second down and four. Givens takes a shot over the middle, and that's going to get them down to about the five-yard line. But there's under two minutes left to play in the game now, but still a nice connection. Can they get it into the end zone? On first down and goal, it's play fake. Givens goes to the end zone. Touchdown Sooners, and they're going to go for two now to make this a three-point game with under two minutes left to play. Going for the two-point conversion. Derek Givens fires to the end zone, but his pass is going to be knocked away there. And so now they got to get they got to get into the end zone at least one more time. So they're going to attempt the onside kick, but the Buckeyes recover it. Third down and six. The Sooners need a stop here, and they're going to get one as they sack Mr. Dwayne Burton on that play. Can their offense punch it into the end zone now and take the lead late in the game? Well, they got to convert this fourth down with under a minute left to play. Givens goes down, though, sacked on the play. And the Ohio State Buckeyes are going to win the national championship in year three of this dynasty. In year one, it went to Florida. Year two, it went to Michigan. And now here in year three, it goes to Ohio State. The Buckeyes undefeated this season. I believe they had said they were 12-0. and as they carry their coach off the field along with their shiny new trophy. And then after this game here, Coach Choate, he gets a, uh, an offer to renew his contract with Montana State. They are, uh, are glad with what he has done so far, and that's good because that means we can continue this series. That's going to be a wrap for this video. The offseason will be coming out soon. Thank you all for watching. This has been Jeffrey reminding you to stay moist.